What's up, YouTube? I'm Mr. No Name or Max, as people know in the real world, and today I'm bringing you guys a 4v4 competitive blitz gameplay on the map Freight. I'm using a vector, which is rare. This is from a tournament where coaches were allowed. I don't remember what round from. Probably just the first half of this gameplay, so enjoy that, guys. Uh, first things first, I need to remind you guys there won't be a video on Sunday because I am flying out tomorrow morning at 5 o'clock in the morning. Yikes, it's early, but whatever. Um, and then I won't be back until Sunday, like late Sunday, so I won't have time to make another video or to upload anything. Um, I might bring one on Monday, just depends on how I'm feeling, but for sure by Tuesday there will be another video. Uh, a lot of you think that we're going to a LAN event, though, this weekend, and you guys have been wishing us luck, and I thank you guys so much for that, but the LAN event is not happening anymore. Well, it is, but at a much later date, and that sucks. So basically... The the whole th let, let me give you background first. So we've been wanting to go to a LAN event for like four to five months now, and we keep kind of pushing it off, going we're not quite ready, we don't have enough practice time, we don't have the money, it's not the right location, things like that. We finally found this one, the Maryland Madness DXD Gaming Tournament thingy, and we're like, okay, payout's not great, but it'll be good LAN experience, and three of us are within driving distance. So we thought it was awesome, and we went for it. Um, I'm, of course, the only one flying in, and of course, you know, five days before the event, the event organizer tweets out, hey, my contract in Florida got extended into the beginning of April, so the LAN event is rescheduled to April 19th. That's five days before the event. That is beyond unprofessional. Um, apparently, he doesn't have staff to run it without him, I, I guess. There's no other reason. Um... And, you know, we called them up asking, what's going on here? Can we get reimbursed? Can you put it back on? I mean, I'm flying in, and this is non-refundable. It was like, no, sorry, you, your team should have had a pickup. Nobody should have been flying in for this event or anything. Which, you know, we were going for the experience, not for the money. So I guess he doesn't understand that. But, you know, it's whatever. Um, but, yeah, he is refunding the LAN event ticket, which was only, like, 50 bucks. Our organization head paid for that. That was uh, David. He'll be getting his money shortly, hopefully. Um, but, yeah, you know, he seemed to not really have that much sympathy. I mean, he kind of did. He said he was sorry that we were going to lose money from it, but, you know, there's nothing he could do. Uh, the airplane ticket would cost $50 to cancel right now. And then I'd have to use the airplane ticket within one year and then pay a $200 rebooking fee. I can't guarantee I'm flying anywhere within the next year. And I don't have the money for the fees. So that was out of the question. The hotel money would just be gone. The car rental, maybe we could get the money back. So we're just going to go up there because it's not worth just wasting the money. We might as well go up and pay $50 extra to get food. Um, and we... Are just gonna go hang out, maybe meet Levi, go to a museum, see a movie, something like that. Uh, hopefully, a bunch of cheap stuff that we can do easily. But um, yeah, you know, I looked into possible legal action against this guy. Uh, the person I've been contacting, though, has said that we would have to go to court, small claims court in Maryland, which would take a long time. It would cost us a lot of money. There's no way we can do it. It's not worth it to get our money back from it. So basically this guy is going to get away with it. Um, there's nothing we can do about it, which really sucks. But hopefully you guys learn from my mistake here. Don't go to a LAN event unless it's in driving distance. Or if it's a major LAN event, then you know, you, you're you probably safe. They probably have enough staff. You know, If it's an MLG, UMG event, things like that. But if it's a local LAN, uh, just don't unless you're in driving distance, apparently. So hopefully you guys learn from my little mistake. I did make a video on this commentary topic a few days ago when I first found out, but it was a little too heated, so I'm remaking it now. Um, hopefully this won't piss anybody off or anything, but, you know, just kind of a rough point. Um, basically... I'm losing all of my money that I had saved up, and my mom's losing all of her money as well, so it really sucks for us, but whatever. As you guys can see, we're coming to the end of this video. If you enjoyed it, then please like, comment, and or subscribe. If you didn't, then let me know how I can do better next time. Constructive criticism goes a long way, guys. Until next time, everybody, peace out.